Hello guys and welcome back to another episode of Super Mario Galaxy. We're definitely in the home stretch now. Uh, last time we beat the last Hungry Luma Comet, finally got all those star bits required, and beat some more purple comets and stuff. Today we're gonna do the same thing. We're, we're gonna go through some more purple comets and stuff, but we're, we're nearing the end of all of them, so that's good. And then we can start focusing on some other things. So this is the purple comet in gold leaf. I don't remember this one either. Purple coins in the woods. This might be another one where it's like we have to go around and get all of them. Oh, no, no, no. I remember this. Okay. So this is a time limit one. But I don't remember it being like a hassle. So I think we'll be fine. So that's good. Let's do it. Yeah, we have three minutes and 30 seconds. That's not too bad. If you do the math, that means we have like two seconds to get one coin or something like that. I think. I don't know. Here we go. This isn't too bad. And they're all in order, too, so that's nice. So, like, you're not really gonna miss one. So I appreciate this level being not super hard. Okay. Oops, come on, man. Is there one right here? No, okay. <laughs> I'm like, what's, what's that suspicious looking platform right there doing? All right. Looking good. So it was 3.30 and we're now halfway done? Okay, cool. So yeah, we, we, we've done that within a minute. So we should be good, assuming that the purple comments are about the same distance away from each other as before. Alright, 57, 58. Let's get these guys. Uh, okay, so I'll, I gotta go back this way. And that's a bit of a mistake, but that's okay. Alright, let's go here. Ah, oh, come on, man. Come on, Mario. You should have 70. I have 70. Alright, cool. That's good. Making us go through without the B power up either. Not a problem. Now oh, missed those. Oh well. <laughs> okay, this is a little bit tricky here because we gotta not fall off. Or else that would hurt our time a lot. Okay, there we go. Made it. 84. God, hey, let me put all these on the edge. Oh, that was weird. <laughs> okay. Stretch out the thing. Here we go. That totally can't be taken out of context. <laughs> Did you get 90? I do. Okay, we're good. So, I'm not sure what the best way around going around this thing is, but hey. This is definitely a, a way. Okay, and... Three, two... One. So there you go. With 43 seconds to spare, not too bad. Probably could have done that a bit faster. Oh, 42 seconds to spare, because it still ticks down after you get all the purple coins, but hey. Definitely could have been worse. We could have not succeeded, so I'll take that. And there we go. Now we're probably going to have to either pay up some com uh, star bits to move around them, or I guess get them to appear in the first place. Or, uh, go back to the other strategy. But now that we don't need to worry about star bits anymore, um, then we should be good. Donk. Oh, whoa, what the heck? That was super weird. <laughs> okay. Um, so let's, let's, I'm just gonna pay this guy up. Because I don't need to worry about Starbits anymore. Hello, oh, oh. move it. All right. Yes, please. <laughs> okay, let me have it. <laughs> All right. And let's see here what's available for us today. All right, last Gold Leaf Star is available, so that's good. It's actually a blue comet. We haven't seen one of those in a bit, so that's a bit exciting. 
It's always it's been a lot of prank or a lot of purple comets. A lot of daredevil runs. I feel like those are the most common. All right, and I'll just fall down here. Here we go. That didn't result in anything horrible. And let's see here. Boink. And we got the cosmic comet in orbit. Here we go. Cosmic Mario Forest Race. This should be another fast one here because it's a race, so that's good. Glad to knock these out. And this one's even shorter than the last one. We just have to get over there. But, of course, that assumes that we win the race, so... Let's do it. Oh, I guess we start out from down here. <laughs> okay. Hello. Come on. All right. Let's do it. Oh, no, don't do that, Mario. Please. This guy kind of knows what he's doing. Okay. Actually not looking super hot. Okay, you know what? It didn't go super well. Don't you dare. There we go. <laughs> I barely beat him. <laughs> oh my god. Alright. Oh jeez. My house is dying, but... Okay, sweet. So I'm glad we got those out of the way. That was a close one. There are definitely better ways we can do that. And I backwards... Or I, yeah, I high jumped at the beginning. That screwed me over, so... There we go. Might as well check the map beforehand, even though I know what the fate's gonna be. Okay, it's fine. But hey, we only have the garden left to do now, so... That's looking good. Alright. So let's do the same thing here. Just rinse and repeat here. It's kind of dumb how this works, but whatever. I don't understand. It's like they expect you to have other stars to deal with. Yeah, I'm not that crazy. Okay. Let's see what we have available now for us. And... Whatever that one is. I think that might be the... I think that might be the cringe one. The... what's it called? Um, the the dreadlocked. <laughs> d -d 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 Duel. All right, let's see here. Let's let's see if I was right. I think it's it's either gonna be dreadlocked or melty molten. The melty melty molten one's cool. The dreadlock one is hard though. But it's dreadlocked. Okay, or dread now. Dread now. That's what it is. Okay, this one's hard. <laughs> um. So hopefully I can actually do it. Purple comet in orbit. But this one sucks because you're on a moving platform and you have to get all the coins. It is like, and they all come up pretty fast. So it's not like, you know, necessarily time consumingly tedious, like go through the whole level type of a, a pain. It's, it's like, you know, you can't mess up type of a pain. And of course one fall is gonna screw you up. And they even give you a little life bonus because they know, you know, it might help, but it, realistically, it doesn't because the problem is if you get hit, chances are you're gonna fly off into space. Um, I guess it'll help against like the little electric barriers, but other than that, you just you really got to be careful with the purple coins. And it gets really tough as like you see here, like the gravity switching, and you gotta you know focus on that and focus on keeping your depth perception intact. Looks like right here we're pretty good. And, you know, if you miss one, then it's like, you got you, you really have, like, only a second or two to react if you miss one. So, that's the tougher thing about this guy. I don't think there's any... There is. Okay, good thing I checked. 
I was like, I don't know if there's any purple coins on top of that thwomp. But you see right there, like, I barely had enough time to do all that. And now right here, things are going to switch up a bit. We got to go on to this guy. And, you know, you better hope your depth perception doesn't get screwed up over here or else you're in deep problems. So, okay. All right, good. That's probably the... Uh, and also, you know, you, it sometimes switches your controls, and you gotta rearrange that. Okay, avoid that. Shoot. <sighs> okay. No, other way, Mario. Other, other way. See? That's what happens. Is, is you get screwed up, and you, you're like, you know what? I'm gonna go forward. Oh, wait, no. That's actually gonna go backwards, because I'm on anti-gravity mode. And yeah, it's there's no checkpoints. It's just go back to the beginning and don't screw up. But they even give you a one up too cuz they know <laughs> it's going to take you a while. And they're just like it's going to take a while. Here's here's this one up. Don't mess up. Good luck. <laughs> that way like if you do screw up, you know, it's not going to get you a game over at least. So at least that's something. <laughs> but this is probably one of the hardest stars in the whole game. Um I know I keep saying, like, oh, yeah, this is one of the hardest stars in the whole game. But for this one, I really mean it. Um, I also would typically mean it for the... The Dread... Or, not Dreadnought. The, um... The... What's it called? The White Comets. The Daredevil runs on, um... The Daredevil run on Ghostly Galaxy, where you have to beat Boulder, Bouldergeist. That's also probably one of the hardest stars in the game. And the Trial Galaxies are up there, too. The Trial Galaxies actually aren't too bad. They're just actually super long levels. So you have to... They kind of really test your um, test your limits on the game. But prob those are probably the hardest stars in the game. So, yeah. All right, here we go. Let's not mess this up this time. We're, we're ahead of where we were before, so that's good. But now we have a lot of cannons to deal with, so it's like, one's gonna shoot at you, and now you gotta be like, okay. Avoid them. Because if a cannon hits you, it pushes you into the foreground, and you're gonna, you're gonna fall, so. Don't do that. Okay, here we go. So we're missing one. Um, hopefully it's on the top of this guy, and I just can't see it. I'm missing one. Um, actually, no, 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 we're not, because we have this. Right here. There it is. <laughs> okay, I nearly had a panic attack. The game trolled me. But there we go. So I really mean it. That's a hard talk. That's a hard start right there. You did it. Wow, you really worked for it. The, like the game knows, so. I remember that one was not fun. But thankfully thankfully we actually pulled through. I'm I'm surprised we actually did that second try. So, good for that. Metal Station's purple coins. We're at 113. We have seven more left to go. So, let's see here. I mean, it's probably not going to spawn one in, but hey, might as well check. Nope. <sighs> All right. I wish I could just be like, hey, pay the 20 and then move it right here, please. <laughs> okay, and jump long jumping there takes me to the other side of the map. So that's not super cool. The lights are back on. The lights have been on for a while. <laughs> Alright. I sure hope I have enough star bits to actually uh, <laughs> do this. I should, but you never know. Snacky doodly doodly doo. -doo, -doo. Alright, what's available for us now? Okay, so that's not a hard one either. Um, and by either, I mean uh, not, not as the previous one. Okay, hold on. The, the quickest way back up is this way, definitely. Don't long jump, or backwards jump, I guess. Through this guy. Okay. So this is going to be the Daredevil run of, I believe, Deep Dark. 
It's either Deep Dark or Melty Molten, I didn't see. Oh, Melty Molten. Okay, this one's gonna be a bit tougher than the Deep Dark one. Because this is Fiery Dino Piranha. If you remember correctly, I took some hits from this guy. But, you know, as long as we're smart with this and we actually can dodge his attacks, it's not too bad because this is a really quick boss fight. Uh, oh, wait, no, it's the Lava Spire. It's not the boss fight. Interesting. Okay, then this isn't a problem. Because, <laughs> honestly, the only things you can really get hit by here that won't kill you are those little um, lava guys that are around. So as long as we're not, you know, going to cringe it up and get hit by those guys, then we can just basically go right through this. Um, also, all this stuff is in the way, but hey, that's okay. All right. Yeah, I was prepared for it being the Dino Prana boss fight. But then again, if we do screw up anyway along the way, we have to restart the whole thing. So that's like not a really fun time. So I don't really want to do that. Okay, this part I always die at. <laughs> so I have to wait for this to do its thing. And now we go. There we go. Yeah, I'm not gonna worry about any extra little things. Our, we'll, get, we'll naturally get enough star bits here. Actually, this stage is really generous with star bits, so that's good. I do like that. And also, you know, you don't want to cringe up and, you know, <laughs> take your eyes off the screen for a minute and then it's on a one of those planets that are just lava. Okay, so this part, I'm just gonna be super safe here. Because it spawns in these little lava guys. Don't want to get hit by that. Ooh, 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 ooh. That was a bit unsafe, but that's okay. And there we go. Good enough for me. Now just remember over here, we have to shake our controller a bunch. I think it does it one more time. No, okay, this is fine. So now over here, we got to get the star chips. And once again, a good strategy here is to take care of these guys. Obviously wait for that. Then they can't take care of us. And they can't defeat us. Okay. Really? I shook. <laughs> for real. I totally shook. Okay. Okay. <sighs> So, alright, that kind of shows you what can happen here. Alright, that shows you what can happen as well. <laughs> you know, I love how I, I did it again, where I said, this is like, oh, it's not going to be too bad, and then this is going to end up being like the hardest star in the whole game for this so this playthrough. Uh, it's It's... It's just my thing, I feel like I just, whenever I'm like, oh yeah, this isn't too bad, it ends up being the worst thing in the whole game. It's just, I think, I, I, I've, I've explained this before too, because it happens so many times, it's just I let my guard down because I'm like, oh yeah, this isn't that bad of a level, and then it's instantly like, okay, actually, it's a decently hard level. Um, to be fair, I didn't think I was going to have to go through the whole level with one life, that kind of sucks, so that's a thing. Okay, here we go. All right. And don't cringe that up. I mean, there's like a significant amount of stuff we have to go through. So, yeah, I, I, no, you know what? Take back. I, I want to take back what I said about this being an easy star. Um, I don't remember it being a hard star. <laughs> I'll, I'll admit to that, but there's a lot that we have to go through here, so, um, no, this is, this is a, actually a significantly tough one, so, I want to take that back. <laughs> okay. So I think there's, like, even after this planet, there's still another planet before reaching the final, like, collapsing area, so. Yeah. 
And I'll definitely admit the harder parts are going to be the beginning. The, the last planet shouldn't be any harder. Duh, I... Okay. I have to blame the controller on that one. Um, I, I was shaking and it wasn't registering it. And I, I'm not necessarily going to be like, oh, the Wii's stupid. It's just because these are super duper old controllers. And I, I've been actually complaining about that before. Where, like, I was shaking and it wasn't doing anything. Um... So that, I forgot to factor that in. This is going to be hard as balls. <laughs> oh my god, this is probably going to take up the rest of the video. Okay, so... Just for the amount of times that, like, you know, when I need to shake, I'm not going to shake. And the erratic pattern of the little cinder guys. Yeah, this is... This is... I I seriously underpredicted. I was going to be like, this is going to be an easy star. Haha, uh -huh. I didn't realize this was going to be as easy. Realizing... Where, where in reality, it's like, oh my god, this is actually going to be stupidly difficult. So. Yeah. Okay. Alright. Prepare to see uh, the same thing a bunch of times. Because <laughs> I am going to mess up way too much in this star. All right, because even when I'm like really careful, I can't be like super careful because the problem is like the little little cinder guys will start overwhelming you if you just try to avoid them. Because like I said, they have an erratic pattern. They're not necessarily they just like chase you. They kind of stop and then go and then stop and then go. So it's something like it's better off to it's better to put them out. Like if, if you're going to get close to them, it's better to try to put them out. Um, and it's like, it's unclear how, like, close you have to be when they're doing their thing. So it's, it's a mess. Alright. Here we go. <sighs> okay. Yeah. These guys suck. Okay, there we go. We're at least getting a little bit closer. But look, look how many of these guys there are over here. Jeez. Got him. Okay, this guy's gonna cringe. <sighs> Alright. And then the last one's over here. Of course, there's a bunch of these guys, though. Okay. 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 Okay, let's, let's just speed back there. I'm not gonna care about the other little cinder guys. Let's go. Okay. Okay, I think this is it. The, the last planet. Time. Okay. Here we go. Now, I can't be like, oh yeah, this is going to be super easy, because there's still the little cinder guys. Oh. I don't know if you guys saw, but I fell in the gap in between right where the lava was, but the cutscene barely saved me. <laughs> oh my god. All right. Like, because it triggered the cutscene and it spawned me back in place. That, that's insane. But yeah, there's still these guys here. It just sucks. Okay. And it's like, I can't be too careful, because, you know, okay, that's a pain. It's fine. Oh, wait. Ground pound. We have 208 stars. Star bits. It's kind of crazy. Okay, here we go. So let's see here. Still one of these guys. Just avoid him. I think, yep, just avoiding him is a good way to go. This guy, do that, okay? Now let's break open this crystal, come on, Mario. <laughs> There's like a delay when, when we shake, so that sucks. There we go. <sighs> okay. That was a tough one. So, I don't know if I'd put that on, like, you know, hardest stars in the game. But that's a tough one. You just kind of have to know what you're doing, and I, I totally underestimated it. So... There we go. We did it, though. Lava Spire Daredevil Run increased our star bits by more than enough. So, there we go. No, I'm no longer worried about not having enough star bits, but let's see. Maybe by some luck. Nope. All right. There's only three left, though, and we can probably do one more today. So, let's, let's do that. Let's do one more. Wrap it up. 
Alright, I'm on the complete opposite side of the map of where I wanted to be, but hey. It's okay. Wee, wahoo, okay. Yeah, well, here we go. Alright, cringe lord. Let's, let's see here. We're gonna have to spawn some back here. Please do. And let's see what which one the game gives me here. Okay, so we have the speedy comet of the dreadnought, I believe. All right, that's what we're gonna have to do today. I don't remember any speedy comets of dreadnought being a hassle, so hopefully this one won't be bad. Honestly, the speedrun comments aren't usually horrible because when I'm let's playing, my instinct is to already kind of like you know not be super slow about things, you know, just to, to keep the content rolling. But um, you never know; sometimes these can cause problems. But yep, speedy comet and dreadnought. So let's see here. This we'll wrap it up with this one, and then next time we'll have the purple comet of melty molten and the. Daredevil Comet of Deep Dark. So here we go. Top Man Tribe Speedrun. Okay. Yeah, this one shouldn't be too bad. Because, like, yeah. So this is the boss fight one. <clears throat> so we just kind of have to be quick here at doing our things. But this guy right here, like... <sighs> we can do that. <laughs> Is what I was trying to do. Now for this, we need to shove two top men into this guy. So one, and here's our other guy. Okay, don't shoot him back. All right, there we go. Now it's free. They give you over five minutes to do this. I didn't realize this was a long star. Okay. And then for this, I think it's just, okay, so then we get these. Okay, so I don't even need to worry about, let's see, can I, <laughs> I can. Okay, that's kind of cool. And then the things are gonna appear. Okay, cool. Oh, this part, right, this part sucks. Okay, I do remember I screwed up here twice, and it is go back to the beginning if we screw up again, so this one we do have to take a bit slower. Okay. All right, so far so good. Let's go here. Wait for it to blast and then go. And then right here we have to do this little thing. There we go. Okay. So took our time a bit and that's no big deal. This guy, we can honestly just kind of dash through. I imagine. If we just jump over the laser beams and we'll be fine. Just kind of timer jumps to it. Yeah, a bit too late. It's fine. And there's one of these right here too. So that's super nice. Really? It's fine. And then this guy right here. Just do that. Get some little star bits. And now the, now we're getting to the boss fight, so that's not too bad at all. They give us way more. I mean, I wouldn't, I wouldn't go as far to say they're super generous with the time. But there definitely is no shortage of it. Okay, so, yeah, now we have 3 minutes and 30 seconds to beat the boss, and I don't think it's going to take 3 minutes and 30 seconds, but that's just my hunch. So... Like, look at how easy this boss fight is, actually. You can just... Oh, there we go. Look at that. 3 minutes to spare, so that's pretty fun. Okay. We did that pretty well. I'd, I'd just like to say... Then again, uh, yeah, I'll, I'll, I'll admit it. They, they're pretty generous with the time on that one, so. 
Yeah, <laughs> I wouldn't be, you know, I'm gonna go off on a limb and even say I wouldn't be surprised if that was a coding bug and they actually meant it to be like three minutes and it was five minutes instead or something like that. Because that's, that's seriously generous with the time, but yeah. All right, cool. So we did that um, and that's gonna be it for today's episode. We still have two more prankster comets to do and we have the trial comets so we'll spend the next two episodes doing those there's also one more um actually two more stars after that one of them which won't count as a star but then there's like a finale star and i think we can still fit that into the next session so i'm thinking two more episodes then we'll be done can i like long jump all the way down here i can all right interesting so yeah be sure to stay tuned for next time i'm just gonna go over here to see how many stars we have left but be sure to um like the video and subscribe uh if you're new to the channel and like it if you enjoyed but yeah we have five stars left okay so two and then the three on the side okay so i guess there's a finale star that doesn't like count as a finale star but yeah thanks for watching and i will see you guys next time